in. Welcome back, guys. This is Bob Knight here. Welcome back to a walk in playing. Anyways, one of those, uh, those games where I have the day, right? What was thinking? Game called again? Damn, I'm so. No, no, no. Co uh, Kokoro Baka Monogatari. What does that mean, anyways? Alright, uh, let's just do it, right? Boku Chum begrudgingly stands up. My name is Yaki Sopa. Mokuyobi. I'm a third year. I'm a big fan of the what? Shane the Fruit and I don't even know how to pronounce that word. Similar concepts. I like making new friends. Mokuchel sits down eight times faster than she stood up. Ah, uh, that was certainly a serviceable introduction. Next. My name is Soda Genki. Say it. Don't spray it. I'm a third year, just like my best friend, uh, Mokuchan. Let's see. What? Damn it. I shouldn't skip too fast. I play all the time. It's my dream to win the Olympics gold medal one day and get some brand deals. Feel like I have a good shot at nailing some sponsorship with my PepsiCo or something. I mean, my family name is Soda. I like be a pun or something. You are a pun. Genki chan's family so uh, named Soda. She must be powerful in order to share the name with one of the most uh, world famous beloved carbonated beverages. Okay. How admirable. Good job, Soda son. Next. Oh, this, this, this chicken. Okay. Right. My name is Bitch Kuru. I'm a third year, just like everyone else in this room. We're in the third years. I don't know why it seems to be a part of this introduction. You think that would be understand understood? I guess it doesn't matter. Not much matters when you come right down to really. It's all pretty a shine through the proper lens. I really like socks puppets, so also birds. They're pretty cute. You seem like quite a colorful individual, Bichu san. Now then, how about the new girl? Shit! I think she means me. Time to go for it, I guess. My name is Player Two. I'm a pretty average girl. I like basic things like pumpkin spice lattes. What? What is that? Eggs or Uggs? I'm gonna assume it's eggs. I don't know what. Wait, Uggs? Do you mean the shoe? The, the shoe bread? Yoga pants and big salads at a cheesecake factory. When I'm feeling especially raunchy, I go to the convenience store and search for a trashy no romance novel. I always find the one with the me uh, meatiest young hunk on the cover. Lovely. Alright everyone, let's buckle down and get to work, shall we? <coughs> oh great, here comes the boring school stuff. I hate school so much. I hate dusty old books and learning shit that doesn't matter. Hey, that's true. Well, it depends on what you do, right? So most of you won't even touch calculus for, for the rest of your lives, but... Some school requires you to learn calculus, which I... It's alright for me. But above all else, I fucking hate chalkboards. Who invented those things anyways? All they ever do is re make really unpleasant sounds. You can never probably erase that shit. And half of the time, I can't even read the teacher's disastrous attempt at motor skill competitors couple to see that passes for handwriting these days. This is the 21st century. Why don't we have whiteboards? I mean, they're still not that great, but they're an improvement. I have to agree with that. Alright, ladies, listen up. Tell me the most important things in the world right now. Go! Your inevitable death? My dad told me it's using real charcoal for the barbecue. None of that propane shit. My own inevitable death. Second tell on princess parts. What? What? <sighs> I mean, fiasco responsibility. How appropriate. That sounds like the good as I'll get from you, girls, though. Obviously, all of these girls are incorrect. The most important things in the world is being able to speak well. Come in. Command of the right languages synonymous with success. How do you think I got this job? Because I can talk good. So in order to train you girls for the harsh re reality of the world outside of school, I've been decided to start off a class with a spelling bee. A spelling bee? This isn't good. I can barely read, let alone spell. 
is this this is gonna be a disaster but in order to make things interesting I would like to pair up off your teams or two just like volleyball I guess so yeah like volleyball the volleyball is so tight I just want to fit some balls right now and score some points good for you Silva son yeah fucking some dudes out with my pumping style spike like that shit certain force get some kills that's the name of the game shush please refrain from speaking I'm going to pair you off with alphabetic order nice that means we're gonna be partners Genki-chan for real this is so rad what? No, no, never mind. Sora, Sora san, you're with player son. <gasps> you're fucking real right now. For real right now, I'm with the Ice Queen. You mean the girl from the Let It Go movie? No, you dumb slut. You know exactly what, what I mean. That, that mouth nightmare. Bitch, you son. You're just doing it this to make me miserable. I honestly have a slight idea what you're talking about, Yaki Soba san. Besides, Let's help make an effort to be polite to our classmates. How do you think bitchy son feels about being called a... Was that mouth nightmare? I don't mind so much. I've been called much worse. And actually, mouth is a fairly accurate description of my skin color. Excuse me, bitchy son. But now is not the time to disagree with authority figures. I know it's cool and edgy and you will score some credit out there in the yard, but it's really j just not the time. Alright then. Girls, buddy up! And in a dramatic fashion, Kiki-san slammed her tiny desk into mine. Battle time! This is it! Kiki-san's Kiki is clinging at me. We gotta give it all we got, Tuchan! I'll never hear the end of it from... What's that? Mokuyobi son, if Sora Genki, the most competitive girl in the school, does not win this challenge, I'm gonna kick your ass real loose. You hear me? I laugh a little bit. She's kidding, right? I'm not kidding. If you fuck it up and don't deliver a sick, nasty flowers of victory, I'll beat the ever loving shit out of your third year's ass. I'll be, I'm a black belt in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and I have kicked much larger asses than yours. Okay. Okay. I'm sweating more than usual. Here are the rules. I'm gonna play cassette tape of a nice man speaking words to you. You have to spell these words correctly using your data computers. Seriously, turn your volume up. It ain't fucking around here. Sounds simple enough? Good! Battle start. Your word is... Troglodyte. 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 Oh shit! Wait, wait a second! What? Oh my god, I, I, What the heck? Troglodyte? I'm really bad at spelling! Troglodyte. Is that wrong? Damn it! Trog maybe it's still two L's. Trogolite. Damn it. Okay, dite. That's how you spell it, right? Tro fuck it. No! Damn it! So much on the place on you're incorrect. Bitch, you saw Yogi Soba son, you are correct. Next question. Your word is. Charade. Sha. Raid. Okay. Charade. Charade. Okay. That one's easier, right? Alright, good job. Nicely spell, Soda son, and player son, you are correct. Bitch, you saw Yogi Soba, you are correct again. What? Next question. Your word is. Anthropomorphized. Anthropomorphized. I'm not gonna get that right. Anthropomorphized. Oh, 
I don't know. That is so bad, oh my god. I, I, should I Google shit up? No, no. This is gonna be a true spelling test. I'm not, I'm gonna fill this shit as usual in school. M. Intro. Pro. Intro. Okay, hold on. Maybe without the H? Is it pro? I already forgot. Damn it. Ah, fuck it. Deep breath, focus. Bitch, son, you son, you are incorrect. Please take the seriously for yoga swans. Okay, they got also got incorrect. Next question. Your word is enamored. 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 Mord. Is that how you spell it? Enamored. With the E or without the E? Ah, fuck it. Shit. We're gonna sew it. Oh my god. Your word is unenthusiasm. 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 I know a lot of you are like, BK, you got it wrong, you dumbass. But. I really bad with spelling, I have to admit. Um enthusiasm. Damn it, I should use my phone. This is cheating! Oh, I did spell it right. Oh. I did spell it right. Holy shit. No idea. I knew it. Oh my god. That's that's great. Impressive. Well, I'm going to cheat for now on it, so. What the fuck, Ice Cream? We should have gotten a perfect score. This is all your fault. You're right. We wouldn't have got a zero if it wasn't for me. No way. You're dragging this team down with your attitude. Attitude has nothing to do with intelligence. If anything, it's inversely proportional if you any indication of a, cor a correlation. Stop making out words trying to sound smart. Honestly, bitch son, you don't need to prove anything. It's just a game. Okay. Players on you some of you have scored two points. It's all my fault. You idiot, I can't believe we lost. You didn't do shit, Genki Chan. You didn't do shit! How do I just run all the spelling considering I was cheating on my last question? We could have got you know just one right. Haha, <laughs> in your face, Genki Chan. Who's the big shot now? I'm sorry, Genki chan. I didn't mean to be so dumb. I can't even spell a few simple words. This is so embarrassing for you. You're telling me. But you know what'll be more even embarrassing? I'm gonna punch my face in as hard in your face that your teeth will fall out. And then, after you shit your pinsu, I'll shove that shit right in your toothless mug and show you what a skinny, sticky garbage woman you are. And from that there it gets pretty gross. So it's best that I stop explaining and just kick your ass. That sound kinda hot actually. Get ready, turd burglar! You 
you're gonna wish you'd never born after I kick your sorry excuse of for an ass. Is there something wrong with my ass? That's enough, girls. I have another wonderful announcement to make. Is the school going to start offering a suit? What? Is Susie and the CR service? Of course not, bitches son. How? My, my bird? I, I could have used a, like less English intensive word. I'm pretty bad at English. In the effort to improve our collective spirit of conformity, the faculty is implementing a new grad grading system. You'll be paired off to two teams and work on a presentation that will be presented to the headmaster by the end of the month. Teams? Again? Uh oh, this isn't good. I'm sure that Moku-chan and Geki-chan will be partnered up since they're best friends. I'll get stuck with bitchu son. You don't have to decide who your partner will be just yet. You can sleep on it if you want, but by tomorrow, I'll like an answer. I already know who my partner will be. I always gotta pair with my best Tomodachi. Geki-chan. I knew it. Not just yet, Moku-chan. <gasps> Moku-chan looks taken aback. What? Why not? I cannot think anything else right now, but except, uh, except, cutting my revenge on this idiot filth woman called Player's Son. <sighs> Actually, I haven't got to register what exactly you're saying right now. I'm just responding to a stimuli. Oh sure. In that case, let's make this quick. Kick her ass, Kiki Chan. I'm really scared, but. Also, it's turn. What? 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 This also kind of turned me on. Is this what losing your virginity feels like? No, she's just kick, kick your ass. I drag my feet to a basketball court behind me, behind the school. A feeling of dread is creeping over me. This is a moment of truth. I'll be forced to fight this golden goddess in a single combat. How can I expect to be her? She is so t toned, lean and muscular. Her every curve has a beam with string. Even her breasts look like they could beat me up. I might was just throw in the tower now. What is this? Mogu-chan and bitchu Song have showed up. Now I have an audience to watch me die. This isn't good. I get performance anxiety. Opai-sensei? What is she doing here? Uh, Opai-sensei? I, you sure you're supposed to be here? Sure, this is a character building opportunity. Just look at the bright side. What bright side? You tell me. She's right. I've never thought of it like that before. Player son! Damn! Geki's not taking a combat stance. Her battle banana blows in convenience and semantic, uh, semantic gusty wind. It's obvious that Bushido Ko f flows through her veins and illuminates her caramel skin with a radiant, bloodthirsty energy. Damn! Prepare for the naughtiest pony of your life. I really did want to get pounded by Genki chan, but qu not quite like this. Oh, we're so cheating. Back for forgiveness, assume the feet of what? They're both pretty lame. I was gonna go like Ugh. Back for forgiveness will assume the feet of position. Well, at least uh, I'll have my dignity and back for forgiveness, right? We're not gonna go into feet of position yet. I figure my best bet is to just ask for nicely not to beat me up. After all, what kind of chance do I have against this uh, Amazonian battle maiden? Wait, Genki, don't strike me down just yet. Why not, Dork Lore? Give me one good reason I shouldn't clock you in the, into the next dimension. I can think of several reasons, but I'm not quite sure if any of them are good. There are children starving in a third world country and you're just to let this go to waste? What? Shit, I was thinking about reasons to eat vegetables, not reasons why I shouldn't have my body pounded into the grisly meat pile. Time to get serious. I will just test you that time. The real reason why I actually a 10 time world champion MMA fighter might kill you for your fight. <laughs> We're gonna get so destroyed. What am I saying? This is a complete fabrication. 
Wow, really? Could it be working? I was worried your puny weakling that was just gonna cave your skull into one swift blow. I'm happy to hear you put in a fight. No, this is going terribly, but I can't let my car down now. You'll be moved to the end for me. Oh yeah? Don't think too hard of yourself, Ginky. Your moves can't be as powerful as mine. You lose if you fight. If you fought. It can't be helped. I'm confident you'll be defeated by my strength. Believe it. That's Naruto. I don't think so. You'll be able to withstand my secret technique, the player master control. What? Secret technique? You didn't tell me about that before. That's why it's a secret. Good point. But if it's really a stat secret, why don't you just tell me about it? Good point. But I will still totally wreck you. Yet, I doubt that. So then, how about it? Shall we begin our battle? I'm telling you, we shouldn't fight. You're digging your own grave, Soba san. This will be the end of you. Oh, but you will fight me, player son. It is your destiny. Is it? Because I think your destiny is to give up or be up being by my awesome power. Ha! That's a laugh. You haven't even seen how much power I have. I'm the most powerful girl in the school. All those who have met me in combat have been destroyed by my power. You'll be no different. Oh, guys. oh god. You were a lot of talking to action. Let's see that power I have so much about from you just now. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. So got our ass just kicked. Alright, here it comes! Kiki lunges towards me at a great speed and her fist connects my jaw at the, such a velocity that I heard something crack. Speck of blood and a piece of my can canine to fly out of my mouth and spatter it on the grave pavement. Gravel pavement. I collapse my knees as I glare at my adversary. I wipe the blood trickling down my mouth with my wrist. Good shot, Kiki son. I cough off some more blood. I'm getting a little aroused. Is this normal? I don't know. Nothing's normal in this game. Come on. But I won't go down that so easy. Ha! Another good joke from you. You'll soon be another, yeah, another victim of the Silva Clan Martial Mastery. Oh really? Call me crazy, but you make it sound like you're descended from the honorary bloodline of superior fighters. But I am! My blood is so sick and gnarly that I'm naturally ultra-powered. Could this be true? Does the blood of the ancient warriors flow through this third year battle vixen? That means not that means nothing to me. You haven't seen my final form yet. Oh yeah? Then bring it on, player son. Give me all you got. I didn't expect her to cut my blood. I need to do something to look more powerful than fast. I rifle to my underwear. Keep things, um, and it's just because I wear a skirt and don't have any pockets. Don't judge me, okay? <laughs> I find my lucky monster bottle. This was a gift from my aunt and uncle. Once my cousin died, this bottle of monster was all that it could be found in this ashen remains. Since then, I kept it at panties for good luck. Ew. Ew. I think you finally may just come in handy. Ha, huh, I just go Super Saiyan. The hell? I threw the monster in my hair and used like styling gel. My hair is all spiky and yellow. Totally cool. I tried to rid my shirt sleep in the Herculean shoulder strength, but it's harder than I expected. So instead, I just rolled my sleep up. My arms are really that muscular, muscular though. This looks like more in intimidating than my head. Here I am, Genki, the lovable Tu Chan you once know is dead. In her place stands a new Chan, an improved legendary Super Tu Chan too. You look like my dad. I think I'm going to kick your ass twice as hard now. Oh fuck! Oh no! Genki sweeps me off my feet with a low kick. My body slim against the concrete. I wish she was sweeping me off my feet in a romantic sense rather than this. This is just awful. As I lay to prove my blood, I can see her whitey up with a downward punch. So a proper blast! 
Ow! Ow, 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 ow. Cry, Saba. Holy shit. She's a fucking beat of shit. No, no. Stop her! Oh shit, fuck! Huck! No! Kick it, stop! I threw you up. Oh man, this is so gross. Shit, okay, I think she's gone. She's done. Had enough, Lenny Chan? I'm Lenny a pool of blood. Vomit and mustard cover my bruise. Oh man, if I wasn't so terrible, would really bum me out. I give up, US Sobasa. Please stop. Yo, nice! KK Chan's turns off my motionless husk of a body and waves at Moku Chan. Did you see that shit? I think that was a new record. Moku Chan's waving at a tiny flag with a picture of a Geki's uh, face on it. I wonder if that's a homemade or custom ordered. Later, losers! I clear, clearly you're not cool enough to hang with me and my main girl. Any kind of that may have been said between us are now null and void. Prepare to enter the lame zone. Yeah, you idiot, Dorkmeister. You can go suck eggs or whatever. It's that little pansies do when they get their asses handed to them by a real woman. We'll see you around, Tu Chan. Try not to drip blood all over the basket of court so I may slip and get hurt. That's so mean! Well, this is it. My first year of school, I got beaten up and rejected by cool girls. They're not cool. All that shit I was saying this morning about getting a fresh star sounds like an idealistic bladder right now. I feel such a damn fool. There's nothing that can happen right now that will make my day even any worse. Oh, you. I stand correct. What do you want, ice cream? You look kind of hurt. I was wondering if you were okay. What? You want to know if I'm okay? Yeah, I mean, I know it's like to get beaten up by soda, son. You take it pretty well for your first time. My pit burst during my first. <laughs> Man, I didn't even have the guts to trash talk, talk her like you did. <laughs> then again, you do look like a complete idiot with that mustard hair, so that's one cool consolation for me. Well, thanks. I guess. I think I should be okay. I might need to grab a little pick-me-up pouch from the blood bank. But I'll live. Those two tend to treat everyone like trash. I know what it's like to feel like a loser. Isn't that because you are one though? True. I was almost allowed to forget that for a second. Regardless, I think it's pretty clear that you are a loser too, af too after that thrashing. Do you think maybe we can be losers together sometime? Is she hitting on me? What? what? I thought you're a bully weirdo or something, but you're being so nice to me? Haven't I been explaining this all that this entire time? What are you? An idiot or something? The cool girls pick on me. They pick on you. We stick together. Things will be better in some minuscule way. Well, was. Well, what? While I always did find bitchy sound to be a supple, sumptuous buffet or, uh, of sinful delight, I didn't expect her to be so kind. I think I might have found my true friend here at Sakura Blossom Academy. I'll be okay with us to get together, bitchy son. You can call me Kuru. Okay, Kuru son. She extends her hand and out to me, I take it. She held me to my feet. So, what? As I begin to walk towards the gate and interest the basketball court, Kuru-san Kuru -san slipped on a blood spatter. Whoops. Sorry! Wait, wait, what? Kuru start? It took me a few weeks to recover from Genki's beatdown, but I'm okay now. Doesn't change the fact the class is so boring. Seriously boring! Yawn Snorsville. I hate this place. I hate it so much. And not just because the class material is as dry as sandy vagina. What? what? Sandy vagina. Man. Weeks after week, Mokusan and Kiki san have been tormenting me and my new friend Kuru's chan. You think that me getting my hiney wood by Kiki chan was bad? Hell, man, that was just a. 
Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce that word. Do you like that word? And P does. I learned it from Kuruchan. She knows a lot of fancy words. <laughs> and by the way, what was I saying? Oh right, the torment last week to put out tax at my penny loafers and peanuts in Kuru's bento box. I think peanuts kind of bossy, so normal that would just be a delight treat. What? I think peanuts are kind of boss. I guess she likes peanuts, but Kuruchan is definitely allergic to peanuts. Oh, Pisces, they end up inject, re injecting the EP pin into her ass cheek. The week before that, they pushed me down for a flight of stairs. Normally, that would just result in a broken rib or something, but their setup was more devious than that. Moku son is truly a criminal mastermind. Moku told Kuru the story of the high school uh, demon goddess that would only appear if she performed her forbidden ritual. Kuru Chang's scientific curiosity got the better of her, and she ended up performing the ritual in the very stair that was being pushed down, in accordance with Moki, uh, Moku's son's plan. She was holding a knife for blood sacrifice when I landed right on top. Oh my god, really? Oh, that means she was blindfolded too? She thought it was being attacked by a demon goddess, and so she was stabbed me a few extra times. <laughs> All right, this seems to be going long now. I'm gonna stop right here. This seems like a good series. I'm I'm serious, guys. Um, save. So, so far we failed the we failed the spilling test, and we got our asses beat up. Maybe things would would have been different if I got the spelling right. Maybe, but uh, yep. Just remember to tune in on the third part. I I don't. This seems really interesting. This these guys will make these game really good. So thank you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys, and thank you for guys for watching. Peace out.